Hello everyone, a very warm welcome to you once again. My name is Nick and this time we're reviewing Panic on the ZX Spectrum 48K, although the game was originally coded on the 16K, we're playing it on the 48K. Also known as Space Panic, this one's published by Microgen in 1983 and based on the arcade cabinet Space Panic from 1980 by Universal. There's lots of different versions of Panic but I've uh, picked this one at sheer random and I do like Microgen from games before so we'll see how this conversion works. Now, I'm controlling that yellow guy down the bottom here. There's spiders or aliens um, running around because you're trapped deep underground with your auction supply. Oh dear, I've had it here. No, your auction supply is gradually going down. You see ticking there. We must knock holes in the floor and then um, when these aliens go to repair the holes, we can stamp on them to death. And once we've stamped all of them to death, we go to the next stage. So it's basically surviving. Right, here we go. Stamp. Boom, there's one died. We've got to kill the other two. Now, once we've killed everyone, we go to the next stage, and there's more aliens about, and I've died. Oh dear. So check out the oxygen. So we've got to do it on a timer. Don't get killed. We've got two lives left in the top right there. And um, avoid everything. It's quite an addictive game, this. Quite straightforward game. But uh, the aliens... Now, one thing I would say... If the aliens repair a hole and you don't stamp on them, they change colour and they become even more powerful. This means to kill them, you have to knock them down two holes. It's probably going to happen now. That one on the top left is going to change. Oh, I've died. We didn't see that. Oh, well. Now, the the level changes each time. It is at random, so you're rather dependent on these ladders. Three aliens, first of all. We do this level. I think there might be four on the next one or five aliens next. So you've got the idea, haven't you? I'm doing it on keyboard. Hopefully we can get off at least one level, but you never know. Now I'm a big fan, one of my favourite games of all time. Oh, there's a chance here. Oh, so I've mucked this up. Yep, okay. Now one of my favourite games of all time, hurrah, is Horace and the Spiders. And the third section of Horace and the Spiders... Ugh. No, that's game over. The third section of Horace and the Spiders, I'll get this sentence out eventually, is very much like this, but much more advanced, where Horace must stump stamp on spiders on a big spider's web so it's much more in advance than this this is pretty basic but good fun as well there's no timer on horace and the spiders this one does oh nicky i'm getting worse and worse come on now did you have this one back in the day or any other versions of panic then let me know uh, we might try another version every now and again as we have done on space invaders die 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 good right two left as we have done on space invaders but, you know, this is classic times, 1983, very early days on the ZX Spectrum and gaming in general. But I am I am smiling a bit on this one. It's quite good fun, really. It moves well. It's pretty basic in animation. Um, these aliens going around are quite cool, too. We've got lots of oxygen left. You can't knock a hole right next to the ladder, so bear in mind. You have to be a bit precise with the keyboard up and down the ladder, left and right. You can't go off the screen and go the other side. You can't dig any holes at the bottom of the screen. You can only do it in the green brick world. Right, chances. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm, yeah, oh dear. I was struggling then. The keys the keys aren't the best in the world and you can't redefine them. I was trying to do Z and W at the same time there, but I, I think I'd slipped as I was looking at the microphone at the same time. Always more tricky, the game. This is my always my excuse. Always tricky. Trying to commentate and play the... Oh dear. Play the game at the same time. Oh, that was lucky. Bib, 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 bib. Sounds as, as expected, really, using the ZX Spectrum blipper. You can drop, drop through the holes. You won't die there. Oh no. One of the aliens is going to get extra strong. Right, one of the aliens there has turned cyan. So you have to knock him through two holes simultaneously. Or that's that. If he repairs another hole and I don't get in, then he goes white. So now he's like a, a super alien. Right, yeah, so you have to knock a hole underneath him and knock him down two at the same time. I don't think this is going to be enough. No, it isn't. Let's take out this guy. Bip, 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 boom. So, just one alien left between me and the end of stage one. Can we do it? Right, I need to knock a lot of holes, I'd imagine, underneath each other. Um... Can't seem to be two, two holes in a row. Oh no, he's going to go white now. 
So I need to knock him down three holes. I think it's going to go white. Yeah, it is. So I need to knock him down three holes. That's almost impossible. Need to line them up here. Oh no, you can't do a hole on the ladder. I've really mucked this up big, big time. Let's see if we get lucky here. As I hit with my golf club thing. And again. Yeah, well that's not going to hurt him. And oxygen is running out big style -y. I think we're going to run out of oxygen here, folks. Man. Kill the aliens when they're just in red mode. That's what you need to do. If you don't do that, then you, you are up against it completely. I've never played Space Panic, the arcade game from 1980 by Universal. If you have, let me know. Does this play quite similarly? I guess it must do. But, you know, you can't beat these early arcadey games. Pac-Man, Space Invaders, Panic and a few others too. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to get this bloke, no matter how much I hit him. Because it's just one in a row, he's just, um, he's just having a field day here. Well programmed this, I do like the sounds. And um, I'm dead. Boo! Oxygen 1135, whatever that means. Right, I'm determined to do at least one stage. Let's have another go. Right, three left. We'll focus on we'll focus on one at a time and hopefully we'll get lucky. Don't get the aliens going different colours. Come down here. I'm luring a trap for them. Don't know who these aliens are, but I think I'm the invader in this, this sort of situation. Um, it works better with Horace and the spiders, really, because the spiders are continuously repairing a web. Um, aliens underground, that doesn't quite work. Oh, this has gone wrong again, has it? No, come on, Nick. Get up there. You've only got a limited amount of time. Boof. Right, two left. Two left. Right, going well. Oh, no, I'm never going to get up there, am I? Come on. Go, 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 go. Get off the ladder. Get off the ladder. Get off the ladder. Oh, oh God. It's all gone wrong. Beep, 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 beep. Come on, I don't know who what this dude's name is. Oh, they're both... Oh, no. Watch this. Blue and red, blue and red, blue and white. It suddenly got 35 million times more tricky. Yeah. Come on. Come on, sir. Yeah, three holes. You'd have to knock them right down from the top here, and the alien has to fall from a great height. Not going to happen here. I'm just a beginner. I didn't own this one back in the day. I presume it came out on other systems. Well, at least Panic came out on everything, I think. But not necessarily this version by Microgen. Right, okay. As I told you the last time, um, I'm going to complete stage one. Hopefully. Mind you, it doesn't say the stage names, though. Just survive as long as you can. Come on, go in the hole. Man, why did they not go in the hole? They know that I'm trying to trick them, I think. Come on, come up here. I don't want them all coming at the same time. Yes! Boof, 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 boof. Gold club, boom. Right, two left. Right, set the same trap. Let's not overcomplicate it. Same trap again. As long as they get in that hole before I've run out of oxygen, I'm happy. No. Yes, right, round we go, round we go, round we go. Yes, just like your brother. Boom, right, one left and he's in red. Set the same trap again, Nick. Yeah, these are the tactics. Come down, alien. Oh, why isn't he coming down? I probably... Because there's only one left and I can keep an eye on him. Oh, hello. No. Because there's only one left and I can keep an eye on him, I could probably do a lot of holes everywhere and just follow him about. I think that must be the tactic. Because he's just playing with me now. He's not going to go in that hole. I'm not sure what the computer AI is here. Yes! No, he thought about it and then bottled it. Boo. He must be wondering where his other friends are. Oxygen's about... Hmm, about... Not quite halfway. Right. Let's let's tempt in here. Go. Oh man. Try and track his path. If he falls in the hole, right. He, if he comes down to level three, he must fall in that. Yes, yes. Here we go. Stage one's gonna get done. Bop. So how many aliens do we get in the next stage? We'll soon know. Is it gonna be three, four, five? One, two, three. Oh, it's five. It's gone up by two. So as you get further on, it gets more and more hectic, hence the name Panic. Don't panic, Captain Mannerin. Uh, uh, well, panic now. I got surrounded. Right, random stages each time, I'm sure I mentioned it. Not through the brickwork. Brick work. Now when there's lots on there, it's best to um, get a few early. The problem is when you're uh, beating one alien to death, another one could creep up behind you, which is always a worry. 
Space panic underground. Oh, oh no, that don't look good. And that's the end of that. Um, I love this game. I really, really like it. I think we'll have one last goal. I love it. It's quite basic. 1983, my favourite era of gaming. Could have been bad, could have been a bad conversion, but it's good. This is classic Spectrum gaming, which always works best. Keep it simple, that's what I always say. I'm not quite sure how many different versions there are of Panic. I'm guessing dozens, if not hundreds. Like the footsteps? Bib, 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 bib. Right, okay, can we trick these fellas again? Right, we're knocking out the top here. The problem is, you can't take out two aliens at the, uh, oh, at the same time, so when you're knocking one and another one's in the hole, it could change colour. But concentrate on one alien at a time, maybe one trap, that's what I'd say. Got plenty of oxygen and, oh no. One life left and then it's probably uh, good night Vienna. <laughs> it's good night. Well, I hope you liked having a look at that game. I, I really loved it. Um, classic retro action, good bit of nostalgia. So thanks for watching that again. That was Panic on the ZX Spectrum 48K, originally for the 16K, published by Microgen in 1983, and based on the arcade cabinet Space Panic by Universal in 1980. Hope you liked having a look at that one. Got any comments about this game, similar games, or anything retro, then you're more than welcome to put those below. That's what the channel's all about, creating discussion and sharing memories. Until next time, take great care of yourself, and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye.